and we'll grab a flint and steel. And one of the things that I have to do as well is I have to work on... Right, yeah. I could put a sign on here that teleports you up. So that instead of like having to climb the stairs all the way, you can just teleport yourself like up to the top area. Because I think it's doable. Because I think it... Well, I know it's doable, but like... I think you can definitely do it without having any issues. Like, I think you can definitely teleport straight up and then it'll, like, you'll appear, like, up here kind of thing. Yeah, so all the teleport signs are down to where they need to be. Uh, I did use creative mode slash spectator mode in order to be able to get the actual find spots because, of course, if it's survival, I would be dead. <laughs> but, yeah, I did all that. That was awesome. And, uh, yeah. So, this area I do need, still need to work on. I need to get rid of, I need to find a way to, well, not really find a way, but I just need to make a command sign that gets rid of these six blocks and then replaces them. So, like, two command signs. One that will actually get rid of them so that you can enter the secret storage behind there. And another one that doesn't, that, like, replaces them back in there. So, yeah. That's all I need to do. But... Yeah, so I'm thinking, like, for this area in particular, I could have, like, banners, the banner with signs here, and then for the end portal, have signs here that will do it, or or reverse it, so, like, to get to the end, you have to click on these ones, and then they'll open up this floor, which will lead you to the end. And, oh, I forgot to, I forgot to clean, fill those in. That's what I forgot to do. Anyway, yeah, so let's go open up the nether portal. This will be the first time we actually enter the nether. I gotta go down for one second, though. Because we gotta go collect a few things. Okay, so we need these, of course, because we need extra storage. Can never leave home without it. Like, why would we ever leave home without extra storage? Uh, let's see here. I should probably go to the kitchen area, seeing if we have any golden carrots to get a hold of. Alright, cafeteria, do you have any... Of the... Ooh, I could... I could grab a steak one. Steak could be more useful, actually, to be honest. I'll throw that there just so I can have easy access to storage. Cookie. Mushroom stew. I know I color-coordinated, like, one of these at some point. So I'll just do that again. Cake. Yummy. Right, yeah. I think that was from our random excursion last time. And that's just cooked stuff, yeah. And do you have you have golden apples? Golden carrots, there we go. I'll just grab all of them then. I'll just grab all of them. Okay. How many do I have, like, in terms of just stacks in general? Five stacks. That should be more than enough. I shouldn't really need much of anything else. There we go. Oh, in case anybody is wondering, uh, here is what, we, what the Behemoth Potion does give us. It pretty much just makes us... I don't want to say immortal, because it doesn't really do that. Pretty much it just makes it, it makes it easier for me to just, like, traverse through the world. And before anybody says, does this break the rules of the server? Not really. Uh, I did pay for it a long time ago. 
even if I didn't pay for it a long time ago, it was way before we even established the rules. So, it's free game at that moment. Alright, let's head to the nether for the first time. Alright, first things first. You got the stick of justice. There you go. Perfect. All right. Ow. Jerk. There we go. I was going to say, there's another one. All right. There we go. All right. Uh, I don't want these on my hopper, though, so I can move them down. All right. So if you don't know what our goal is for Lord Cube, we need a netherite block, specifically with netherite scraps that we've gotten from this nether because all of our other netherite scraps and blocks will not have enough power pretty much to give lord cube his energy back so what i'm trying to figure out is if i could find a spot in which that would actually be perfect for our random journey So I'm trying to find a way down, but down in an area that makes sense. And I don't know if different nether biomes have different netherite or ancient debris yields. I don't think so. Because I don't think this is like an emerald kind of situation where you can only get it at like one biome kind of situation. I think it's just a Y situation, like diamonds and stuff. Yeah, okay. Uh, what Y level are we? 44? Yeah, I think like down there probably would be a good, better idea. Also, another reason why I really wanted to have the beam with potion, it comes with fire resistance. And I never leave without my wings, so. Or my elytra, so. Hooray. <laughs> cool. Oh, great. Oh, one more. All right. There we go. All right. In a little bit. Okay, we're at 32. It's not too bad. Uh, tw oh, I went to the wrong one. 26. Huh, okay. Is there a reason why there's lava here? Or no. Come on. Oh, that's as close as I can get with it? Okay. I mean, I could go around. It's not that big of a deal, but still. Ooh, quartz. Not really what I'm interested in right now, though. Just an underground lake area. Kind of looks like it. Or is this leading up to the surface? I'm sorry for the thing. I wonder if there's a way you can make lava at least look appear a little bit better when you're under the water. I thought there was a an improvement, but I think it's because if you have night vision, I think it's it's improved better or it looks a lot better with night vision or something like that I think that might be what it is okay 
So let's go inside more. So let's go over here. I just want to make sure that I'm in the right area or in the right ballpark, if you will. Oops. So one more up. Thank you. There we go. We need to go up to like 15. Yeah. Gonna try and go around here. Yeah. I might not have gotten like the best area specifically to go do it though. Hmm. Okay. So, let's head back out. While I'm hitting my head on everything. But then again, I don't really have much of anything for this. No, you're not having my Hershey's. Yeah, mine. Yeah, my Hershey's. Alright. Uh, ooh, Phantom Fortress. <laughs> Not really what I'm looking for, though. What I'm looking for, in particular, is our portal. Uh, it's over here, then. There we go. I found it. Hey, buddy. Get down here. There you go. And the thing that you have to remember about, like, the behemoth potion, though, is that, like, it's... What? Where am I? This is an Arcanix. This is nowhere near Arcanix. Uh huh. Yeah, I gotta figure out how to leave this area. I don't know why it brought me here. Do I need to go down and then back out again? Like, do I need to go, like, up here then? Come on. Come on, man. Where's an exit, man? That's not an exit. Nowhere near an exit. Is that not gonna lead me anywhere? Like, am I seriously like stuck down here because I don't have a pickaxe? To be fair, the portal should have brought me to Arcanex. I don't know why it brought me to a random cave. Like, why did it bring me here, of all places? Unless, does the nether portal have a cap and how high in the, uh, in the height limit that it can spawn? Because I think the nether portal is, like, close to height limit. And if the nether, like, has to be, like, at a certain radius, or no radius, well, technically, yeah, radius, from 
how it is in the overworld, then technically, yeah, it would, it wouldn't spawn where mine is because mine's like too high in the height. Because I think if, because I think if the Nether were to be like actually like fair in where it would spawn me kind of situation. So I should probably get back to where I was, which is very difficult in the dark. Don't get me wrong. You guys are seeing the dark. I am also seeing the dark, too. I was trying to see if I can get another pickaxe before I left, but that didn't really happen, now did it? So here's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to find out where that water area is and see if I can go up it. I think I... I think I'm in a different area. That's why I can't find it. And I got turned around. And I'm still getting turned around. Alright, well, since this is another problem.